I'm Julie, Bay Fan Ballser, and today I'm going to talk to you about a new feature on your Scan and Cut machine. It's called smoothing. Into my scanning mat, I have just placed a quick little sketch of a piece I want to cut, and now from the home screen, I'm going to choose Scan. And then Scan to Cut Data. I'm scanning in black and white, which is fine, and I'm going to hit Start. <laughs> My scan is very faint, but as soon as I hit this outline button, I can see it very clearly now. Now I'm catching the edge of the paper, so I'm going to bring this in here. But I also want to point out a really important button here. This is called smoothing, okay? And if you click that, you can see that the smoothing is automatically set to low. And as you can see from these icons, if you turn it all the way here, that's off, you're gonna get a more angular cut. If you turn the smoothing all the way to high, then you're gonna get a more rounded cut. And I will show you the difference between those two. Here are two pieces that I cut. It's the same exact design. This one was cut with low smoothing, this one with high smoothing, and if you look, especially I think in here, you can see it, how this, instead of being a sharp corner, is a nice soft edge, and even this edge here is rounded, as opposed to the low smoothing, where it is definitely a corner. So again, you can see the difference here. When you do the high smoothing, it's rounded, when you do the low smoothing, it's square. So this can help you when you're getting a scan to get exactly what you want out of the design. Once you've chosen the level of smoothing you want, there is a middle layer as well, then you can just hit preview. You can see it here on the screen. You can even zoom in if you want to see, you know, just how much smoothing are you getting there. Use the arrow keys to navigate. And you can see that this at the medium has just a little bit of smoothing, but not totally taking away that corner. So I'm going to say, okay, okay, again, okay, again. And now of course I can save it into my machine wirelessly to canvas workspace or to my USB thumb drive. So I hope you see all the ways that smoothing allows you to really create the scan exactly the way that you want it. Thanks so much for watching. For more tips, tricks, and tutorials, be sure to visit my blog at ballsdesigns.typepad.com. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, and of course, don't forget about the Scan and Cut website at scanandcut.com. <laughs>